recycled PET bottles, coconut and horse hair, plastic pulled from the sea. These aren't what you usually think of as the makings of an electric car, but that's exactly what students at the Eindhoven University of Technology in the Netherlands have used to build one. This car is very special because it's made out of, all out of waste. So we use all different kinds of waste and also recycled uh, waste, but mostly unsorted waste as well. So our chassis is built out of this material, which is flex and recycled PET bottles. And we have some other cool materials. So that's this actually, and that's what we use in our interior as well. Uh, and this is normally what you throw away in your home as unsorted household waste. So it's very awesome. The two-seater named Luca can reach a top speed of 90 kilometers per hour and has a range of 220 kilometers after a full charge. It was built in around 18 months by a group of 22 students in the university's ecomotive department, some of whom had never had any experience designing cars. And the students say if they can do it, there's no reason why larger automakers can't do the same and more. We really hope that other uh, yeah, car companies or other companies uh, start using waste materials because yeah, we really want to show that it's possible in many applications. And I think it will take some time, but uh, we are seeing that more and more companies are starting to use either bio-based or waste materials uh, in the interior. And uh, we want to show that it's also possible to build a chassis out of it. And hopefully in uh, the coming years, we will also see that happening. According to the World Bank, more than 2 billion tons of waste is generated every year. Plastics in particular take up about 6% of the world's oil consumption to produce, and only about 18% is recycled. Even worse, most plastics have a short lifespan. The OECD estimates that 95% of the value of single-use packaging is lost to the economy. That's valued at up to $120 billion annually. Instead of being thrown to the incinerator or landfill or ocean, these are materials that can be given a second life. Luca is still a concept car. It's unclear what it would take to scale up production to the consumer market level. But it shows the potential value for car makers and other industries of what waste can create. Miranda Lynn, TRT World.